so we know there's a money figure out there. We know the Leafs know this is important for them to do. What is the holdup from this coming together like now? What's the one thing that's holding this up? Well, you know, I think William Nylander is probably pushing for something more like 11 and a half million on an eight year deal. I'm sure the Leafs are trying to keep it to more like 11 million or 10.95 or, you know, but I mean like, and so there can be a little bit of a negotiation, even when you've got to a healthy spot with talks about exactly where that number lands, depending on how the money's paid out and if it's all up front and, you know, obviously there's, there's trade clauses and, and things that go in these deals. Like I think that, I think that even when you get to a healthy spot, there's still a little bit of wiggle room at the end about where it ends up. 